Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 is here, and I have found the new Grau 556. It's it's the Lockman 556. It's just a different name. I'm gonna jump into the loadout in a second here. Then we have a gameplay for you, and then we're gonna jump into the tuning to make sure that you're getting the best of the best out of these attachments and make sure that you're frying as hard as um well my brain because I can't think of an analogy. If you like this sort of video, please hit that subscribe button right below there. Right next to that is a thumbs up button. It does help the video out a lot if you press that for me. Thanks. And let's jump into the loadout. So the Lockman 556 is super easy to use. It has a pretty simple recoil pattern. Then it's just up and then up again. So you just hold down and then down again. So I just woke up and I realized that I recorded the whole loadout and tuning breakdown within just my camera. So I, there's nothing that you guys can see but my face. So I have to re-record that. Anyways, let's go into the Lockman loadout. I haven't had my coffee yet. So this is going to be kind of hard. So first off with the Lockman, let's start with the magazine. Obviously, it's going to be the 60 round mag. You need those extra bullets in Warzone, especially if you're in quads or something. You need those extra bullets to take out multiple people. For the ammo type, you go with the high velocity rounds, pretty much with pretty standard with any AR or uh, LMG or even sniper rifle for that fact. There's a couple options that you can do with these three attachments. Um, personally, I like to go with a muzzle and then go with the Echoless 80. And then on the barrel side of the house, I go with the Lockman Wrap Barrel. The first one it gives bullet velocity, damage range, and recoil control. Now, if you want to forego your muzzle or your barrel, you can go and put actually the FTAC ripper on or you can do this a similar thing uh instead of the high velocity rounds you take your muzzle and your barrel and you keep those on and you take the f-tac ripper or something like the shark fin or the pineapple grip and finally for the optic i always go with the vlk it's just iconic easy to use a clean sight and it's a 4x so you can see at most ranges with it but with that being said i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the gameplay using the lockman stick around to the end we have a tuning section at the end of the video stick around for that subscribe for more like the video comment your favorite part about warzone 2 and I'll see you guys at the end. Coming in with you. He's on there. Oh, I'm here. Never mind. I think there's people in here, so careful. Yeah, I do too. One on me here. Got him. Uh, oh, shit. Coming upstairs, I think? Yeah. Nice. So good. I'm getting another load out of here. Load. Yeah, they're in. Right here. I see you. I don't see them. It's Nox, nice. Waiting, want me to shot out here? I can't see the other guy right now. He's on roof, he's on roof. Okay. I don't know why you get assist after you like they've been 10 minutes away from you. I got people on me here. I don't know. But kind of far. One's sniping further. Stay in front of our building. It's over here. Moving this way. Get in the building. Going up second level. He's cracked on that wall right here. Cracked. Look left, look left. Yeah. Just shot in the back. Uh, I got self. I have to pop it here. Yeah, pop it. Ah, uh, shoot, Rosie. And hit the plate down there. He's in the window in the building. Cut. Should be le no, left. Yeah, he's more left. Yeah. It's just him. That's, yeah, I only saw one. Below the hill. He's through nade. Careful. Yep. You're in front. Two, two, two. Far one's cracked. Got the far one, throwing a flash on the right. Nice. I'm gonna get the pull. Knocked. Try self, man. Good stuff. Good stuff. Gotta come in. Oh, yeah, I like this. Oh, one more on me. Top here, right there, live wing. Good stuff. Was that. A one shot? Oh, one shot, headshot. Yeah. Through I four, through I, purple? I, I, how do you know? I don't know. Was it, were the plates purple? I don't remember. Uh, that's, that's the only way you can tell. Yeah. I'm going to look for this guy over here. Yeah, right here. Yeah. Still 
Moving this way. Moving. Guys are? Yeah. I don't know why the live wasn't working. I'm gonna push that. Should be safe, wasn't looted. You are right behind us. I'm getting lit. I'm, I'm nuts. There's another one for sure. Yeah. Yeah. More left of them. Yep. Ah. Let me fall, let me fall. Let me behind, fall. behind, sorry, behind, behind, behind. Sorry, I was getting shot at. I'm getting shot at too. Yeah. We got in the house. Yep. Oh, I this got is shot out. from southeast. Yeah, right yeah. those are the same guys that were shooting at me. Are they up high? No, they're on the hill, like right here. Kind of pinned. They're getting shot in the back. We can border that too. Oh, they, got, they got shot. Okay. So we can rotate. Let's get it done. Just kind of have to go in now. Uh, you want to go push push forward? Push forward. Just, yeah, to the right. Yeah. I can cluster that hill again. Yep. So you got right over here. Crack. Got him. Cool. Nice. I'm dropping the ammo box. I'm going to play. Yep. I like this Lockman, by the way. Okay. I think As with, you just get gameplays with every other gun. So it right. Matter. Like As with, close. um... Right here. Yep. I got flinched out. It's cracked. Knocked. Knocked. I don't have anything. He's gonna sell. Yeah, That's the last guy. That's the last guy. Oh, okay. I'm gonna push up then. I slid down. Right. Trying to come up. No, I can't. He's right here. Sorry, you. I'm down low. I'm trying yeah, to he just dropped off. I'll get the kill. It's fine. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, I really like it, honestly. Kind of surprised. It has like some decent, like I don't know. It, you kind of it has like an extra kick at the end, so you might have to kind of keep that in mind. Like it has its initial firing up to like twenty rounds, and then it goes, and then it goes up again like a, twenty rounds after that. So just keep that in mind. But it's pretty good. Hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. Let's jump into the tuning for these attachments. I'm going to show you the best of the best options for these four attachments here because you can't attune the magazine. So for the high velocity rounds, the first thing you want to do is do more bullet velocity and more damage range. This helps out with making your shots feel like they're going exactly where they're going to. Next in the Echolist G80, the muzzle, what I like to do is once again, bullet velocity, and then I go to the top here for recoil smoothness. It helps with that like side wobble and everything and it really hones in the recoil control. As for the barrel, you have two options here. I like to go damage range and recoil steadiness. Again, it helps with that recoil control. However, you can go aim down sight speed if you really want to. It's not gonna affect you all that much, and it's definitely gonna feel like the gun's coming to your face a little bit faster. But for purposes of this, I'm sticking with damage range. And finally, for the optic, I always, always, always tune far. What that does is makes the optic a little bit smaller in front of you, so it helps with visual, visual recoil control, making the gun feel a bit smoother than it actually is. And then finally, here's where you go your aimed out sight speed to make up some of that lack of aimed out, aimed out sight speed that we're losing from the other attachments. That's going to be all, guys. Thanks again. Subscribe for more, like the video, and I'll see you in the next one.